can show us what uh, this, we've noticed that this is a... What's it called? Notard. No tail rotor. I've never seen a helicopter like this before. How does it work? No tail rotor. So basically, it's like a hair dryer in your, ho in your hotel room. So basically, you got a fan up here, so it's sucking air in through this through this fan yep and then there's a variable pitch fan in here so it's sucking it in and it's blowing it down this way yep and it's just a hollow tube just like your hairdryer at home and it all comes screaming out of there so that is controlled by the pilot and so you're we can that that's moving yeah. that also yeah so that's like a rudder on a boat and then there's a little computer inside here so it, it it stabilizes the aircraft so we can fly around without our feet on the pedals but we can also fly them backwards sideways okay you can do some pretty cool stuff because you don't have a tail rotor back there that's awesome so is it more stable than a normal Much more design? stable than a normal tail rotor it takes a little while to get used to flying it but cool and then you got these slits running up the boom yeah and it's like a coander effect it's called so like if you're dripping a, a drop of water on your finger and it follows the line of your finger it's the same with the air so as the main rotor blades are pushing the air yep. down, it follows that. So it creates a low pressure on this side. So basically this is the leading edge of a front of an aeroplane wing. That's the tail. So that creates lift, so it's going on. Ah. So that's a flying okay. wing. I what see. It's actually created. I see. That's very clever. It is. Cool. Ah, well, thank you very much for today. It's been incredible. <laughs> Cheers, man. It's okay, man. Thanks Always so much. No problem. See you, mate.